Hello everybody, it's Rad and uh, in this whole video we're going to look into Capricorn, uh, Sun, Moon and also Rising. Uh, weekly tarot reading February 21st up until uh, February 27th, uh, 2021. Uh, 2022nd actually and uh, if you do enjoy the content here in the channel and, uh, you do wish to support us guys just uh, leave a like subscribe hit the notification bell uh, so you do not miss uh, any of our weekly uploads uh, nor our live streams uh, as well as we are doing them every week so with that being said let's make the cut and uh, see what you got uh, first card that you do have capricorn that is going to be the queen of swords uh, followed by the second one here of the nine of pentacles uh, moving next uh, we do have uh, the five of cups followed by the fourth one which stands as the three of swords and the fifth card for you that is going to be the king of pentacles all right so i do want to draw one additional card for the queen and that card is going to be oh my god the queen of pentacles okay so those uh, two and one more additional card for the king of pentacles which is going to stand as ooh, the page of pentacles okay so those are uh, this is your draw and now let's uh jump right away to the reading itself so you can see now your spread on the screen capricorn and uh this will be a week to be remembered and uh throughout the week you will have uh well how do i press into words or well, let's say it that way that you are to come across a a huge deal whether that deal it is about your romantic life or whether it is about your business the deal is going to be ginormous and uh, because it is and there is going to be a lot riding on it it's very humane to um, feel a bit afraid and uh, to put a negative thought into it what if i'm not up to the task you know what if i screw up somewhere what if i'm not good enough and so on and we can see that deal forming up or rather like if you want to call it opportunity be my guest but we are seeing that thing forming up over here uh well in the very first uh initial stage of the week uh, so right at the start we do have the queen of swords catalyzed with the queen of pentacles and that is a person uh, who is uh, these people they do deny failure in general and these are kind of people who are who, who are doing very good job into moving on you know they do recognize when the situation you 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 put enough into the situation and even if you can put even more there and get more results it is just uh, it will not worth your time it will not worth your effort it's just that kind of a person we do have here and thus they are very capable people into a jumping from one lucrative or gaining for enterprise to another extracting the most out of it without over committing and that is a person that you are going to interact with at the start of the week most likely a friend or a counselor or an advisor if you will and uh, that person is going to help you move on from a particular drama or dilemma or just a situation that you are over committing which you may have no idea at that time that you are over committing into it and that will allow you to open your eyes uh, for even a bigger opportunities which are in front of you because such is coming here with the nine of pentacles um that thing is gonna take place from the start to the middle of the week and the nine of pentacles this card is classified as the thing okay so that is either the job or or the person that you you are you are gonna enter in a relationship with or the friend it's just the big thing out there the big fish that everybody wants to catch the moby dick of um, of opportunities <clears throat> And the thing it is that uh, it, it kind of looks scary at the start because it's a huge thing, right? And many things can go wrong. But with the Nine of Pentacles, as Nine of Pentacles classifies uh, the, the opportunity here, uh, actually the start is going to be very easy going. And the whole thing, uh, it, it promises you a leap into development. So uh, 
here because every Capricorn has their own environment, has their own experiences currently. Uh, should your life be very boring at this point and there isn't much things moving on around, well, you can expect that to change at the very start to mid of that week 21st to 27th of uh, of february and i can advise you here by the look of these cards to truly take that uh, that option available because it's going to lead you to a person because if you don't take it guys the reading for you ends it, it's just the week is going to be uh, just a repetition from the previous week from there on moving forward but should you take that opportunity, uh, it's going to lead you to a person that I just cannot even begin to tell you how loyal and how much these, these people have to give. And we can see that person here at the end, King of Pentacles with the Page of Pentacles. But we're going to get there uh, <clears throat> in a few minutes. So you're going to have your chance to make that uh, leap into development and uh, once you do so you are to see that uh, with the five of cups here you are to see well i haven't i did not start it correctly uh so yes you are to see but above everything else you are going to understand that uh, situations literally are not ideal you're going to have these conflicting feelings uh, where you will know that you are on the right track with your life at that stage, that that was a thing you should have not missed and you haven't, okay? But in the same time, the very initial stage of it, it is not exactly what you have imagined, which is going to bring certain disappointments in you. It also may bring certain sense of losses out there. And you are going to start thinking that, you know, history repeats itself uh, because that will remind you of similar situations you had uh in the past and we can see that into the three of uh into the three of swords here which is from the mid towards the end of the week for you <clears throat> and in this stage of the week it's very very important uh, capricorn for you to maintain your sanity by not allowing yourself to dwell into the doom and gloom not allowing yourself to think the worst okay and just try to maintain as much as you can your positive attitude unfortunately i cannot give you an, an advice how to do so those cards are meant or rather like the lesson of those cards is meant to test your emotional and as well mental or if you will spiritual strength how strong you are to push through this endeavor which endeavor like we said it's a huge leap into your either uh, a romantic endeavor uh, a romantic um, a romantic development or a business development i'm sorry there is a dog outside uh so Hopefully you are strong enough because as you move through the week and you are doing what you are supposed to do with uh, with either this uh, romantic enterprise or business enterprise, a person is going to show up here, which is the King of Pentacles, and uh, which is catalyzed by the uh, by the Page of Pentacles, as you can see and uh that person like i said i cannot even begin to tell you how loyal these people are and they do have a lot to give so the the primary reason why this person shows up for you it is because they see an, an enormous uh, value either into you or into what you are doing at that point what you are trying to develop uh so that will read like that should this enterprise is about um your relationship life then that person is going to be very interested in you should that be about your business that person is going to be very interested in your business and uh, they will see an, like i said an enormous value either into the business or either into you and they will have uh, a lot of resources to give whether emotional resources or whether they these are a material resources like funds investments etc etc uh, so you need to know that they are very devout meaning that once they start something they just don't walk away in the first uh, when they have a first signs of danger or of difficulties or of plights they do carry on up until the very end so uh, they are not a how can i put it into words a gamblers 
and uh, that is because they do have nothing to lose well they do but what they are to lose it's meaningless to them because they do have so much more usually very well situated uh, people of wealth most likely people that have a lot of resources and uh, the other thing that i'm going to tell you about them is that they are very generous but their generosity is not charity so they will expect results or at the very least a reciprocal treatment from your behalf of course you may not be able to give back what they are giving you but you can give something different that has a similar value and don't worry should they be approaching you i mean should that person that is approaching you uh they definitely are going to be happy with what you have to offer to them either it is a uh a, an aspect of a relationship or either it is in an aspect of a uh, of a business <clears throat> so the week is going to be a transition at least by the look uh, by uh, by my look here or by my take of uh, of it and uh, should you well you are going to be talking with that person at the start of the of the week listen to what they have to tell you do not ignore them right away because at the start these the advices that they're going to give you may seem unapplicable may seem uh, out of character for you but the more you think about them the more you see that that is something essential you have to do so you can unlock your um, your drive and your movement into the future so you can see something to look forward to which is uh, the nine of pentacles and that transition is going to bring you to through a healing because at the end of the day these uh, two cards we have the uh, five of cups and the uh, three of swords um, they are a cards of healing you he you are healing yourself from a disappointment and from a negative thoughts as well and once you are healed from them you are going to be ready to take on the offer of investment whether it is a uh, romantic investment or a uh, material investment from the uh, king of pentacles who is going to be the most loyal person you have ever met so with that being said uh this was your uh weekly reading capricorn hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like the guys and we are to see each other next time until then bye